the start on the building, they dug a bloody big hole. <laughs> And obviously what they're going to have to do is all these trees, they're going to have to come up. So that's going to be one of the first jobs because you can't do an out without it. So presumably the big hole is to get to the trains or footings or whatever. So we have made a minus start. It's still messing about at the back there. I think they're just having a week of digging really big holes. You can see inside there they've got one massive hole. Presumably that's to get those steels out. So they're just going around <laughs> making very big holes. So the end of the uh, garage is still there. I thought they would have actually finished and been off site this week, but obviously it's last bit's a bigger job than we thought. So there's still a lot of concrete there to be chopped up. <laughs> And whether it's actual footings they're putting in because the that big old it's more like a sort of a trench. So whether that's what they're doing, we'll find out during the course of the week, no doubt. So they've got another really great hole. This is on the main road. So they're definitely going mad with these pretty big holes. Presumably a lot of this is going to be for services. And a bit further up, they're doing, guess what? Another big hole. <laughs> They've actually extended the barrier out, blocked the road, causing confusion, and digging another bloody great hole. It's in a straight line, so again, whether there issues to get mains, water, or sewerage, so services in. Well this is a different firm than the ones that have been doing the demolition. So they've got a hole at the back of the hole and they're making a trench. The view from the other side. So it looks as though we've now got two contractors on one finishing off the demolition and these digging big holes. So I would think possibly the uh, build is on the way. On the other side we can see the digger is basically just flattening the, uh, the service, service surface <laughs> and putting the uh, rubbish in the dumper to be disposed of. Lots of men with shovels and things cleaning up as well so it looked as though they're just getting a level surface. So all this area at the front's now clean. We've still got that massive, massive pile of uh, concrete and a massive pile of concrete behind it that uh, needs chopping up. I mean, very hot weather, chopping it off and spreading dust everywhere. It's not a good, uh, good game. Most parts we're just still tidying up. There's still that really big pile of concrete, two diggers going just flattening the ground basically. Nothing exciting at this end. A few markings on the road, that's about it. Bit of a strange one that uh, the end bit is still here and there's none of those diggers on site to clear it. Still got that metal there, another one here. So quite why they're not finishing that off. But they are over there making more big holes. So that looks like a uh, trench to bring in some sort of services whether it's sewage, water, electric, but they sort of buried it off. So why the other diggers have gone and what they're going to do about this bit here, you have to find out. 
I mean, look a bit closer, they've got that uh, base to get rid of and another one behind it. And the really big hole they had, they've now sort of filled in. So those big chunks of metal have got to come up at some point. But to see the pigeons are still here. <laughs> We've still got that really big hole there. Another view, they're doing a lot of shuttering down there. The rest of it they're sort of flattening off. So that's usually for sort of, sort of concrete, lay concrete or something. at this big hole that they're, they're digging they've shuttered it off so it's quite deep if they got to shutter it off what we haven't got is anybody about to find out exactly what's uh, going on sort of thing there must be something fairly uh, deep and there's a grid there so presumably that's the uh, the sewerage There's quite a lot of activity, lots of people standing about. The digger high up and these marking whatever it is they're marking, so presumably the uh, the build is uh, on the way. But it is a totally different firm. Get a better view from the other side and look at all the different sort of buckets they've got here. So I don't quite know what this uh, digger's doing, apart from hiring himself on the land. Assuming that's so as he can get at the uh, concrete. As you can see, they've still not touched that uh, end section. So and there's still a lot of concrete there that needs to be broken up. guy walking about marking stuff out. Not a lot of activity here, a lot of people standing around talking. Just had it confirmed from one of the workmen that the actual build is now on the way. So we'll keep updated with that, although it might not be very exciting. You know, there's three bricks gone down. <laughs> but. Uh, I was trying to find one of the bosses to find out why they haven't taken this bit down. They thought they'd have done that before they got the diggers off site. <laughs> 